Today in Review This Thing, we're going to review this thing, the Nukem Grab and Go Ground Blind. This is Adrian with Review This Thing. And by now, you should know that we absolutely love to turkey hunt. So last year when we saw the Nukem blinds at the NWTF convention, we knew we had to give them a try. We have actually turkey hunted and deer hunted with them. So we're ready to tell you what we think. Let's review this thing. As always, we're gonna tell you all the facts. The first part is fit. The Nukem blinds come in two sizes. This is the regular, and they say it's ideal for one person. It collapses down to 32 inches and weighs right at three pounds. The height of it can be adjusted from 45 to 53 inches, depending on how much you widen the base. And the base can be widened out to seven feet. Robbie and I each have a regular size because it's perfect for hunting from the ground. When we're running and gunning turkey hunting, we don't want to have to carry chairs and things like that, so this really is ideal. They do say you can use a really low profile chair, but we haven't tried that yet. Now, if you prefer to sit in a chair, they do make an XL version, which can go all the way up to 60 inches. Now, I would assume that that chair is going to still need to be kind of low, especially if you're a pretty tall person. Now, because the XL is taller and can be widened out to nine feet, they say that one to two people can hunt from it. Now, if you wanna hunt with two or three people, there's another option that Nukem has, so keep watching for that. Another aspect that I like is that the window height is also adjustable. A lot of times, blinds, the windows are too high for me because I'm short, but on this one, you can just keep widening it out until the height of the window matches where you need it to be. So because they have multiple options and it is so adjustable, we're gonna have to give Fit a five out of five. Now our Nukem blinds as advertised. Now the main thing that Nukem advertises about their blinds is that they provide ultimate mobility and concealment for the run and gun hunter. These Nukem blinds kind of replace the need to carry in a big, bulky, heavy ground blind and chairs and then stay in that same spot all day. Now, if that's how you like to hunt, then by all means, keep doing that. But that's not what these are for. At three to three and a half pounds, they're very lightweight and provide a ton of mobility. And they come with their own carry bag, which makes it really easy to carry them. Additionally, you can just take down the center pole and leave the others up and carry it around like that. I know a lot of people do that if they're on turkeys and are needing to change positions. That way, the only thing you have to do to set it back up is just replace that one pole. Last year, we also deer hunted with our Nukem blinds. Basically, we knew we were gonna get to a spot and then stay there just for the evening. So we didn't want a big blind to put up, take down just for that one night. It worked perfectly. We each had our own blind and we were able to have good concealment. The deer never knew we were there, worked like a charm, and Robbie actually brought two does home that evening. Now here is where I wanna mention the brand new addition to their line. It's what they call the double up system. And this would have been absolutely perfect when we were deer hunting. Pretty much, you just take two of their blinds and then there's this fabric piece that you put between them that creates a significantly larger hide for you. Maybe even being able to have a second and third hunter and it is like a one pound piece of fabric. I do wish we'd have had that set up last year. Another thing they advertise is that set up and take down take about one minute. I will say the first couple times you do it, it's a little weird, a little awkward because it is like tent poles with that bungee in the middle. But once you kind of figure out how it all goes together, it really is super fast and easy. Overall, the Nukem blinds pretty much do exactly what they say and exactly what they're designed for. So we're gonna have to give as advertised a five out of five. And now on to construction and durability. This leafy type blind is made of 75 denier nylon, and then they have a flat panel design that's made of 150 denier, which is why they are so lightweight. And that nylon has been really durable for us as well. The ones we had last year, we carried around in the woods a lot. I'm sure we went through briars, and to our knowledge, we haven't seen any issues, no tears or anything. As I said, the poles are similar to tent poles with that bungee in the middle, so that they are easy to take apart and put back together, but they are extremely sturdy and feel really well built. You can see here the top of the blind is a see-through mesh. So at the bottom part, you're completely hidden whenever you're sitting down behind it, but then you can see through all the parts you need to be able to see to make sure you're gonna get the shot you need. Not only can you shoot through the windows, but because of that triangle design, if your game should go around, then you can just move over to the side and still shoot out of the edges. Another pretty cool feature is the blinds are stake free. 
So they're designed to just be put up, sit there, grab them when you want to go. But they do have stake loops. So if you know you're going to be sitting for a while or if you know it's going to be a windy day, then you can just bring a couple of stakes with you and that'll help keep them secure in the ground. The flat fabric comes in five different camo patterns, including a waterfowl appropriate pattern. The leafy ones come in two patterns. There's this mossy oak obsession like we have, and then the mossy oak green leaf. And I saw the other day that they actually have a snow cover for it. So if you're hunting somewhere where it actually snows, unlike where we live, then you're not gonna stick out like a sore thumb. As far as durability, we have not had any issues. As I mentioned, the poles are working great, the fabric is still holding up, so we're pretty happy. Now, they do have a 12 month guarantee. So if you have an issue, I'm sure if you reach out to them, they'll be happy to take care of it. Overall, we feel like the design is very smart, it's well built, and so far it's held up for us very well. So, we're gonna have to give construction and durability a five out of five. Now on to testimonials and reviews. Overall, the reviews of the Nukem blinds are really good. I feel like the negative comments people had are more because they kind of don't understand what the blind is meant for. Some of the complaints were that it was too short and they couldn't hunt from their blind chair, it wasn't wide enough, and it's not ideal for bow hunting. These things never occurred to me as an issue because to me the design of this is for that run and gun turkey hunter. So they're used to going and moving, sitting on the ground. This just provides solid concealment to keep you hidden from your game. So if you picture it that way, then those complaints aren't really an issue. And then somebody else complained that it blows over in the wind. Well, it only weighs three pounds and you know, it's basically a big giant sail. So if it's really windy, it probably is, which is why you're gonna wanna carry some stakes with you and use those loops if you think that might be an issue. Well, you know what we do? We tell you the score we found. So for testimonials and reviews, Nuka Blinds get a 4.3 out of five. Now, finally, should you buy this thing? You know the drill, it really depends on what you're looking for. If you're used to hunting from a ground blind where you're gonna sit in your chair, have a lot of room to move around, and you're just gonna kinda stay there all day, then this is obviously not what you want. But if you prefer to run and gun hunt and are used to sitting on the ground and you want extra concealment, then I would definitely give Nukem a serious consideration. These work great for turkey hunting, but as I mentioned, they can also be used for deer hunting, predator hunting, or waterfowl. MSRP is 110 for the flat regular up to 140 for the leafy XL. And you can buy them direct from Nukem or on Amazon. The only other reason that you may not consider a Nukem blind is if you prefer just full on minimalist hunting and you don't wanna have something else to carry or set up, especially if you're gonna be hiking a lot, which we definitely do sometimes. So I'm gonna take just a little bit off for that. But especially for mobile hunting, where you just want some extra concealment, from our experience, the Nukem blind is definitely a worthwhile addition to your toolkit. Should you buy this thing? Five out of five. Hey, thanks for watching our Nukem blinds review video. While you're here, watch a bunch of other videos, like it, share it, comment, subscribe to our channel if you haven't. Check out our website, reviewthisingtv.com, subscribe to the newsletter, Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Pinterest, and check out our holler store and our Amazon storefront.